a total solar eclipse will take place on Monday, August 21, 2017. A solar eclipse occurs when the Moon passes between Earth and the Sun, thereby totally or partly obscuring the image of the Sun for a view on Earth. A total solar eclipse occurs when the Moon's apparent diameter is larger than the Sun's, blocking all direct sunlight, turning day into darkness. Totality occurs in a narrow path across Earth's surface, with the partial solar eclipse visible over a surrounding region thousands of kilometers wide. The eclipse will have a magnitude of 1.0306 and will be visible from a narrow corridor through the United States. The longest duration of totality will be 2 minutes 41.6 seconds at 37 a degree 38 a euro squared 12 a euro cubed n 89 a degree 15 a euro squared 24 a euro cubed w in Mercanda Township just south of Carbondale, Illinois. It will be the first total solar eclipse visible from the southeastern United States since the solar eclipse of March 7, 1970. A partial solar eclipse will be seen from the much broader path of the Moon's penumbra, including all of North America, Northern South America, Western Europe, and Africa. This eclipse is the 22nd of the 77 members of Saros Series 145, the one that also produced the solar eclipse of August 11, 1999. Members of this series are increasing in duration. The longest eclipse in this series will occur on June 25, 25, 22 and last for 7 minutes and 12 seconds. Related eclipses over the United States, this eclipse will be the first total solar eclipse visible from the United States since 1991, and the first visible from the contiguous United States since 1979. A 1991 article in Discover noted that the total solar eclipse of July 11, 1991, that passed over Hawaii and significant portions of Mexico, was the best anyone will be able to see from the U.S. land until 2017. The path of totality of the solar eclipse of February 26, 1979 passed only through the states of Washington, Oregon, Idaho, Montana, and North Dakota. Many visitors traveled to the Pacific Northwest to view the eclipse since it was the last chance to view a total solar eclipse in the United States for almost four decades. Some American scientists and interested amateurs seeking to experience a total eclipse participated in a four-day Atlantic Ocean cruise to view the solar eclipse of July 10, 1972 as it passed near Nova Scotia. Organizers of the cruise advertised in astronomical journals and in planetarium announcements emphasizing the lack of future U.S. total eclipses until this 2017 event. The August 2017 eclipse will be the first with a path of totality crossing the USA's Pacific coast and Atlantic coast since 1918. The path of this eclipse crosses the upcoming path of the total solar eclipse of April 8, 2024 with the intersection of the two paths being in southern Illinois and Mercanda Township at Cedar Lake just south of Carbondale. A small land area, including the cities of Mercanda, Carbondale, Cape Girardia, Missouri, and Paddy Carr, Kentucky, will thus experience two total solar eclipses within a span of fewer than seven years. The solar eclipse of August 12, 2045 will have a very similar path of totality over the USA about 400 kilometers to the southwest, also crossing the USA's Pacific coast and Atlantic coast. However, duration of totality will last over twice as long. An eclipse of comparable length occurred over the contiguous United States on March 7, 1970 along the southeast U.S. coast, from Florida to Virginia. Gallery Related eclipses, a partial lunar eclipse will take place on August 7, 2017. Equals solar eclipses 2015 a Euro 2018 equals, each member in a semester series of solar eclipses repeats approximately every 177 days and 4 hours at alternating nodes of the Moon's orbit. Equals Saros series 145 equals, this solar eclipse is a part of Saros cycle 145, repeating every 18 years, 11 days, containing 77 events. The series started with partial solar eclipse on January 4, 1639, and reached a first annular eclipse on June 6, 1891. It was a hybrid event on June 17, 1909, 
and total eclipses from June 29, 1927 through September 9, 2648. The series ends at member 77 as a partial eclipse on April 17, 3009. The longest eclipse will occur on June 25, 2522, with a maximum duration of totality of 7 minutes, 12 seconds. Series members 16 a Euro 26 occur between 1901 and 2100. Equals Metonic series equals, the Metonic series repeats eclipses every 19 years, lasting about 5 cycles. Eclipses occur in nearly the same calendar date. In addition the Octan subseries repeats one-fifth of that or every 3.8 years. This series has 20 eclipse events between June 10, 1964 and August 21, 2036. References External links, Earth Visibility Chart and Eclipse Statistics Eclipse Predictions by Fred Espinac, NASA GSFC, Google Interactive Map, Basilian Elements. About the 2017 eclipse, animated map showing how the solar eclipse will appear in various cities through the United States, a comprehensive site about the 2017 total solar eclipse, a reference site for the 2017 eclipse containing detailed maps of the path of totality, a site dedicated to the 2017 eclipse with news and event information, resource guide to eclipses in the 2017 eclipse, guide to the eclipse on in-the-sky.org.